Maud, you better stop that. Hi. Hey, babies. Oh, the big littles and the little littles. Look at that little white leg horn with a dash of black. That has got to be big, pretty, and pearl right there. That's who that is, or opal, one of the two. Oh, you girls got some good stuff out here. Probably gave you some eggs. Goodness gracious. They do like to eat an egg. God, Crow is gorgeous. She is a beautiful, beautiful hen. I love black hens. Look at all the green on her. She's so gorgeous. And these little reds, man, they're pretty. They're mean, but they're pretty. They're not like super mean. But look at how pretty she is. Look at all that green, that iridescent green. She's got some blue in her too. She is a gorgeous girl. That is what I was hoping for with the cross between uh, Big Pretty over there and any of these girls. I was hoping for that. I wish there were a lot more of them, but I only have two. That one and her little sister right there. The eggs were, ha were hatched about two weeks apart. She's going to shine up and be all iridescent too. There's some good girls in here. And oddly, the littles that stayed in there too long, in my opinion, but they stayed in there the longest, they are smarter for some reason. And they go right after bugs and stuff like that. Whereas the big littles are just now starting to go after stuff like that. But them little ones, they got out on the ground and they just went to tearing it up and scratching Yep, and Mama is out here, and she is finally a chicken again, and she's doing real good. These girls here, some of these golden sex links, they're uh, I, they're the ones I'm gonna catch and give to my buddy to go with Buddy over there. Look at him; he's like sitting in his little spot. I really wanted him to be awesome, and he is awesome. He's a he's a really he's a good boy. He's just not a great chicken yard rooster he's probably going to be real good free ranging and that's where he's going he's going free range and he's more aggressive so that'll be a good spot for him i am going to divide the yard off i'm probably going to put the broody hut um somewhere over in that area under the trees right over there something to where they're not close enough to the fence i'll probably put it right here and then i'll divide the yard back but I've got to get some fencing to replace my electric net because that's so I can put them out there and keep them off of our stuff so yeah we'll get everything organized a little bit better here soon but I had to take the dogs to the vet and that's 200 a pop per dog and then 150 for six months of their medicine keep the fleas off of them and that just could not wait any longer oh my god they knocked down one of the big holy cow how did y'all do that i'm gonna have to dig a deep hole and bury that real deep i didn't bury it deep enough red you're such a good boy you are you are just a really great rooster you know that you're such a good boy Y'all show me another Rhode Island Red that you can turn your back on at all and trust. Yep, he's a good boy. And BP over there, he just doesn't have a mean bone in his body. He sure doesn't. So he's going to get his own little space with my Bard Rocks and my Buff Warpingtons and uh, probably a couple of the Probably a couple golden sex links and Rhode Island Reds. I'm going to put him in there with them. And, uh, yeah, we're going to really begin breeding because this was just like a, just happened to happen. And I didn't want to fight it and I wanted to let them 
breed some chickens, and boy, I got cedar. The black hen, that's that's what I'm really after is those black hens that will be awesome, awesome laying hens. Big Littles, I'm going to put you back out here with the real chickens. Hey, you, you, I know exactly who your mama is. I promise you I know who your mama is. I sure do. Right there, that's her mother. That is her mother right there. My little mean ass. I guarantee that's her mama. She is like identical to her. That's crazy. And what I find so odd is my big littles, which is the first batch that hatched, obviously. They all have green eyes. Every last one of them has green eyes. Every single one of them. No matter what color they are, they have green eyes. And I think the little littles... It's okay, honey. Nobody's gonna get you. Oh, that's the boy. That's Luna. That's Looney Looney. Yes, it is. That's Looney right there. That's Looney Tune. That chicken right there flipped out one time, and I thought he broke his neck and killed himself. And then, I instead of just, you know, doing what you got to do when you have a dead chicken, I took him in the house and loved on him and stuff and revived him. He flipped out and damn near broke his own neck. Crazy little dude right there. And once I figured out he was a rooster, I was like, oh, that's why he was so crazy and didn't want to be handled and stuff. Because he would lose his shit. Look at all them babies down there. Yeah, they're mixing down there. That's good. God, she's gorgeous. She is so freaking pretty. I hope this one ain't picking up all that iridescence. That is one gorgeous chicken. She's a good girl, too. She's sweet. Hey, you, mean ass, stop it. God, I know exactly who your mama is. Yep, he's going to be off free ranging. And he's going to have some girls. He's going to get some of these golden sex links that are their wing feathers. Never grew back in, so he's. They're gonna go with him. I don't know why they're those particular birds didn't do that, but in my opinion, you just you're just better off getting Rhode Island Reds. I have 28 laying hens. 20 actually, there's 28 adult chickens here. Two of them are roosters, so I have I have actually 26 hens, and I get average 36 eggs a day not every single day sometimes i'll only get like two dozen or i never get just two dozen i'll get i'll get almost 30 every single day but most days i average 36 eggs a day and that's pretty good average for 28 girls i do not feed them layer feed at all ever if you want your chickens to lay like that and have big, giant eggs and just be super happy, man, get Chick Starter. 20% non-medicated Chick Starter. Um, use that instead of layer feed. And get wild bird seed mix for whatever kind you want. I get the cheap stuff because that's what I can get. And uh, mix that. And when it gets colder, I will get a uh, sweet feed. And mix in because it's got molasses and stuff in it. Hello, beautiful big mama. Hi. That's my pretty, pretty girl. Yes, it is. She's so beautiful. It's okay. I know you're still mad at me for not letting you be a mama no more. Maud, Midge, and Margaret, they all get mad at me too. Yeah, Mabel. Maud, Midge, Mar Margaret, and Mabel. Yep. They are going to be hanging out with Big Pretty. Well, two of them aren't going to like that. Hey, leave him alone. He didn't do nothing. Leave him alone. I know. 
I know you get aggravated when you think he's mating with your girls, but yeah, you see these golden sex things? They're feathers. They all got trimmed exactly the same way, and you can see everybody else's wing feathers came back in. But that one way over there, hers didn't, she's didn't, and I mean, the back feather thing is just because of the roosters, but I have, like, I have less roosters than what would be recommended for the amount of birds, because there's 14 per rooster, technically. He really has, like, he's got, like, five or six girls that really like him, that really, really, really like him over it. Brad, thank you. You are such a good boy. You're so handsome. You are the bestest rooster ever. You really are. You're a very, very good boy, and I love you. I do. I love you. And I wanted to love him very much, but he would kill you. Oh, maybe not. I don't know. He's going to be bigger, though, and he's not got an attitude like DP. He's got an attitude like you. Because you, one of your girls, one of your red girls is his mommy. Well, I got everybody watered. Let's go see how the guava tree's doing. I probably need to trim it. I got food all over it. Let's get these eyes in there and stab my feet. And look what's been going on out here since we fenced everybody away from the fence. Look at all that corn coming up from them squirrels. Isn't that crazy? This thing's got fruit all over it for how old it is. It's got quite a bit of fruit on it. And then that one there. I don't know, she's trying to get that top piece to root over. I don't know if you can see that ball right there, guys. She's trying to get that top piece to root. <laughs> oh, yeah? I wish you'd quit talking to them dumbass roosters. They're not smart like you. <laughs> you don't need to relay their messages. I know he does. <laughs> Red, you're adorable. You are. <laughs> Tell him again, buddy. That was a good job, Red. That was a good boy. That was a good boy, Red. Yep, that's a good boy. Let's get this gnarly shit out of here. Stick for the other gun up there. Watch out, y'all. I gotta get this out of here. This is trash. <laughs> This is trash, so we will swing it over there. Yeah, of course it did. There we go. All right, babies. Everybody's doing real good. <laughs> you gonna tell them again, buddy? Yeah? <laughs> oh yeah, buddy. You talking to him, bud? He's like, let me out of here. You gonna talk to him, buddy? He's been in there. This is the fourth day he's been in there, and he's. <laughs> He's actually adjusting pretty well. He's not like freaking out or nothing. He's pissed, but he's not he's not tripping out. His uncle ghost was he didn't deal with it as well. But he's also in here <laughs> with his girls. He's not. Oh yeah? 
You got a lot to say today. I've spent so much time training you and making you just the wonderful boy that you are. And other people get chickens and then they don't train them. And then you start talking to them all the time. <coughs> Is that rooster male? He is a great rooster. I used to have asked for a better rooster than that ever. So, y'all, I got other things I got to go do. I got some music to work on. Got to try to remember how to actually record. I used to want to record in the studio. <coughs> I had Doghouse Records before Snoop Dogg ever came into existence musically. But I didn't incorporate like an idiot. So, you know, that's how that goes. <coughs> Red wants him so bad he can't stand it. He wants to get him, and he wants to get Red. I'm not sure that either of them really want that, but they think they do. What's he saying, buddy? What'd he say? <coughs> Goodness. You get a lot of crossing that one little crow, huh? He is such a diva. Poor BP over there. Hey, 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 don't be mean to the littles. Don't be mean to the littles. And littles, stop, big little, stop being mean to the little littles. Don't be a jerk. Red. Oh, he's so mean. <laughs> he does not like babies, I'll give him that. All right, y'all. Much love, everybody. Y'all have a fantastic day. Grow what you love. And you will love what grows. Bye, y'all.